Recently, I saw someone who resigned from a particular position he was holding. Like, this person is a high-ranking person in the society. And he was appointed to be part of one body like that. I don't want to mention that. But he thinks there are a lot of magumago things going on with that committee and he decided to resign. The reason for his resignation is not the purpose of this video, but the medium by which he resigned. He used a soft copy to send out his resignation letter. In that soft copy, you can see it as a document that is .docx. He probably typed it with Microsoft Word or Google Docs without converting them to PDF. The challenge in this type of letter is that someone can pick it and add more things or even remove something and also distribute it. This might be implicating to this very gentleman who sent out this resignation letter. So in this video, I want to show you how to convert your document to PDF so that it will not be easy for anybody to edit. This does not mean that it cannot be entirely edited, but at least for common people, they won't be able to edit it. I make video around digital tools. If this is the kind of video you would like to see in the future, please consider subscribing. And if you are ready for this exercise, let's dive in. Okay, turning on to my computer, the very first thing I will do is to go to Microsoft Word. I've already prepared a document that I will be using for this exercise. As you can see, this is just a template to show you how to convert a document file into a PDF so that it will not be easy for everybody to edit it. First thing I will do is to go to File and then click on Save As. From save as button, I will choose the destination where I want to save the file. Let me use the browse option. Then I will decide to save it into my desktop. Then give it a name. I can leave it with this name. And then click on save button. What I just did now is to save the file only as a document. And if you send out this file, the person can be able to edit it but because we want to save it as a pdf file look at what you will need to do from the same file option you click on save as then click on browse this time we have file type here file name this is the file name as you can see the previous one that we have saved and this one is still the type is Microsoft Word. This time we are going to change the file type. So I will click here and choose PDF. Once I select PDF, I will also decide whether I want it to be printed. That is, I will be using standard publishing formats. This one is for online and printing option. Then if you intend to only share it online, you can use minimum size so that the file size will be smaller. Though it will have low quality when printed. So I'll be using this so that it can serve for both online and printing purposes. I can also decide if I want the file to be opened. Immediately it's finished converting it to PDF. Once I am done, I'll click on save button. and the conversion process will begin. At the end, it will finish converting it and open it as a PDF. This is now in PDF format and it will not be easy for anybody to edit it. That is by a way of adding or removing any contents of this. This is how to convert documents to PDF using Microsoft Word. Now, the second method we are going to use is by way of using Google Docs. Google Docs is an office application from Alphabet. You know, the company that owns Google is now known as Alphabet. So I have just copied this. I'll go and open Google Docs. From here, I'll click on blank documents. Remember, I have a video in this channel that shows how to use Google Drive. You can go and check the video. I will also put the link in the description box below. 
So I will paste the document that I have copied from Microsoft Word. So now let me show you how you can still do the same thing, converting this document into a PDF. So the first thing I will do is to click on file. We are not doing savers like we did in Microsoft Word. So what we'll do is download, then choose PDF. Do you see it? Once you click on this option, you wait for it to process and you can see our file is being downloaded here we have one document we can see because i didn't give it title you can see here it's untitled i did not save it that's why we have untitled here meanwhile the file has been converted into pdf let's open it boom here is our file in pdf documents this will make your file easy to share and not easy to be edited this does not mean that anybody cannot edit this file if you would like to learn how to edit pdf file please subscribe to my channel again if you would like to learn how to add digital signature to your pdf file kindly subscribe because i'll be doing these videos in a way that you may have not seen online before i hope this video is helpful Please consider subscribing if you haven't done so. Remember to click on the like button so that YouTube will show this video to many others. If you have any question, use the comment section below. If you would like to learn how to generate AI image, I have a video of that. Check the card popping up now. You can also find it in the description box. Until next time, keep learning.